Hey, what is up, guys? This is DJ Frostbite, and ta-da! Today is the grand moment you've all been waiting for, where I get to answer your waiting questions. Yeah, today is the Frostbite Q&A, guys. Um, I just want to thank everyone for submitting all their questions in for me to answer for them. And let's go into the first one. I can't wait. Okay. Baby taco or sexy grandma? Wow. <sighs> Honestly, I'm going to have to go with the baby taco. Why? Because I like babies. And I like tacos. Don't get me wrong. I do like grandmas. But I mean... Sexy grandma, right? Right? <laughs> That's a funny one. Alright, how did you exactly get the name DJ Frostbite? DJ Frostbite. So, how I got the name Frostbite, honestly, I kind of forget. I remember that it was snowing outside, and I don't know. I think that name just stuck. I was kind of, I don't know. I think that name just stuck with me. Because I was trying to th think of um, different, you know, DJ names I could, you know, use as my, uh, AKA. So, I was just thinking of ice names, honestly. It was like Iceberg, uh, Icicle, Free Zone, or whatever. And I came up with Frostbite. And I had to think. I said, you know what? I was kind of edgy on the, the, the Frostbite name, so I said, you know what, I'll keep Frostbite, and I'll see how it goes. If people like it, and if I, if it fits well, then I'll, I'll keep it, but if I don't, nobody likes it, then I'll, I'll change it. And, <laughs> as you see here, I, I stuck with Frostbite, and it's been staying with me since, yeah, the beginning of time. And the reason why I have it or the BYT3 is for copyright reasons because first uh, I originally spelled Frostbite F-R-O-S-T-B-Y-B-I-T-E the regular Frostbite and I was a rock band so I changed it to Frostbite F-R-O-S-T-B-Y-T-E that was a rapper so I said you know what I'm just gonna I'm just gonna change it I'm just gonna change the B Y and then turn the E to a 3 because I've seen so many DJs do that, and it was kind of an original trademark a little bit, and there's been some controversy of people saying that I copied off of Dead Mouse, and I understand what they mean, you know, Dead Mouse, they have Frostbite, Dead Mouse, Dead Mouse, Dead, Dead, first part of Dead, is just regular, Mouse is M-A-U-5, so it's changed, the mouse word itself changed. And they put the number at the end, and it's the same type of formula for Frostbite. So I know what I know what they mean. But yeah, that's how my uh, my name came to be about. All right, next question: What is your favorite vacation? Oh man, my favorite vacation that I've been on so far. Oh, it, going on a cruise to Bermuda. That was awesome. That was the first time I've ever been on a cruise. I believe it was like years ago the experience was great I, I met a lot of new friends there I, met, I did a lot of you know different activities there it was amazing but I think that is one of my best vacations that in Atlantic City or Ocean City New Jersey or anywhere in Ocean City I love the beach so yeah all right next question what got you into YouTube that is a good question um so, I have two hobbies that I like to do. One is DJing and making music, and the other is filmmaking. And what kind of got me interested into YouTube, or the whole film, you know, recording yourself and posting on YouTube thing, was um, my first short film uh, called The Fourth Wall. And I'll put a link in the description below for you guys to see it. It's, a, uh, it's the first video I've ever posted on my YouTube account. And it, it's really funny. It's a funny video. I might actually do a reaction video because that was like a year ago. And um, yeah, it's a horror comedy. So you guys, you guys would like it. If you're not a horror mo movie fan, just try and check it out. It's not too. It's interesting. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, then after that, I kind of saw. 
some of my friends, you know, making channels, doing Minecraft videos, doing gameplays. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna start doing that and start making a community where, you know, people can comment and people can like subscribe and tell me what the heck uh, I should do in, you know, other gameplays or different games or what the heck uh, I'm gonna do. So yeah, that really got me. That was like the basis, the origin of me starting my YouTube account. And it's working out so far. I think it's pretty successful. But, um, two of my goals is to, uh, successfully, um, get the fans out, you know, people who subscribe to me, whatever they want, I will gladly do for them. And the other one is to get that golden YouTube award, that YouTube, um, big huge accomplishment. I think it's like, um, one million subscribers or whatnot, but that's, that's what I'm working for. That's my goal. What is your favorite food, man? I can't, man. <laughs> that is a hard choice. Um, I would probably either go. I have two. I would either go with corn dogs or hamburgers, cheeseburgers, because I don't know. It's something about that that big, huge, juicy cheeseburger. You know, when you bite it and you're almost done, you're like, oomph, get that, you know, punch in your stomach. And then corn dogs are just really fun to eat. You just, you know, it's battered hot dog. Who doesn't want a battered, sugary hot dog? That's that's pretty awesome to me, I think. It is one of the best foods out there. <laughs> just don't get one at a carnival because, you know, they have a reputation. <laughs> what is your favorite movie? I'm a full-out Ninja Turtles fan, so... All of the Ninja Turtles movies, I just love. Anything Ninja Turtles, I, I instantly love. <laughs> it's awesome. I also, I'm going to say any Marvel movie. I love superheroes. Uh, superheroes, I grew up with superheroes. You know, my dad grew up with superheroes, so we got a connection and bam. We go, I see every superhero movie, you know, Ant-Man, Thor, uh, gee whiz, Superman, Spider-Man, the Avengers, uh, Thor. <laughs> so yeah, just that whole action adventure movie genre. I just enjoy full out. All right, and I think this is the last question. What is your favorite Five Nights at Freddy's animatronic? Man, that's very very hard. At first, when I saw this. I was automatically thinking Freddy, because you know it's his game. But I said no. It ha my it, the, that has to go to Bonnie, because Bonnie is this, one of the most scariest things I've ever seen on the internet. Oh my gosh! You type in Bonnie on Google. <laughs> Plus fan-made pictures. Oh man, fan-made pictures. Guy just gives me the creeps. Plus there's like 500 different versions of him. There's like Golden Bonnie, there's Spring Trap, there's Withered Bonnie, there's Shadow Bonnie, there's Bonnie with no face, there's the regular Bonnie, there's Toy Bonnie. Oh my gosh. You're giving me a headache. So, thank you guys so, so much. It was very, very, um, it was fun answering all of your questions. And it kind of made me think a little bit more. So, yeah, I will make sure I will be doing more of these Q&As because I enjoy doing these. I'm just going to wait until my subscriber number gets a little bit higher, you know, so lots of other people can ask questions, too. So, yeah, if you like this video, please thumbs up, guys. Uh, also, subscribe to me if you love my content, if you like my videos, and comment below on, you know, maybe another question you want me to ask in the, uh, the next Q&A. Until next time, guys, DJ Frostbite, signing out. See you guys. Thank you so much.